Hello, best friend, and welcome, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a fabulous day. Happy Monday, happy day. I hope you had a good week, and if you didn't, girl, this brand new week is going to be the week for you, okay? Mark my words, bitch. Anything and everything is possible. Just have faith, dream, dream big, Believe in yourself and let all the negativity out, bitch, including people that do not bring in a high level of good energy for you, okay? Anyways, welcome back to my channel. If you are new, I am Sebastian. I spill pop culture tea every single day, and I am a new messy best friend, bitch. Okay, so listen. Um, Radar Online is a mess, but they are now reporting that Selena and Zayn are a little bit more serious about each other and there's also some rumors going around that allegedly girl i can already tell you i don't think this is true but allegedly they're moving in together listen let, let, let let's talk okay so it it happened about a month ago that this um alleged date happened you guys remember when this a uh, hostess said that she saw uh, Zayn and selena you know sitting in a tree k-i-s-s-i-n-g um no when you know allegedly they were spotted at this restaurant they were making out and holding hands blah blah right okay so we haven't really heard much since about Zayn and selena but there's new reports and new rumors that allegedly Zayn and Selena have become very serious and that Zayn is allegedly Selena's dream man and that they have been flirting back and forth secretly since 2012, okay? So, um, it says that they are literally bound to be together because they have always flirted together. She's always had a crush on him. There's a bunch of videos out there where she loves, you know, she's talking about Zayn and, you know, she's complimenting Zayn and saying that he, she is his favorite from One Direction. And the way that he looked at her in certain award shows, you know, this and that, her on and off with Justin, then The weekend, and then him with Gigi, you know, a mess. But that they finally found each other. Well, Allegedly now, they're searching for apartments in New York because he's allegedly working on new music and she, of course, is filming Only Murders in the Building. Now, listen, I personally think that, you know, if they have found each other and they belong together, then that's perfect. Now, do I think that they're moving in together? Listen, we have not seen one picture of them in public because these reports are saying that they they left the restaurant holding hands and then they walk around Soho holding hands. Listen, if they were walking around holding hands, I'm pretty sure somebody with a phone would have taken a damn picture, okay? Because it is not that hard to spot Selena Gomez and Zayn. Hello? So, you know, I feel like if they are serious, you know, listen, crazy shit happens in relationships. I'm, you know, I had my now husband mo literally kind of move in with me after our second date. Yes, bitch. Yes, bitch. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Um, and, you know, here we are, right? So crazy things do happen. You know, maybe they have been, have this like built up tension and love since 2012. And, you know, she lights up his world like nobody else, bitch. You know what I mean? And she's like, if you're ready, come and get it. Nah, 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 nah. You know, so if they're moving in together, you know, great. But, like, I just have to say, like, I feel like she just has to be very careful with her heart. You know what I mean? Like, I just, you know, I don't know. It's because I feel like I'm a little protective over her. Because, you know, I I, I really care for Selena as a, as a human being. You know what I mean? You know, not me acting like we're best friends, bitch. But you know what I mean? I'm pretty sure you do, too. So, you know, I just want her to be careful. I want her to explore you know i also i mean of course if he's the one then amazing but it would be really awesome too if she like kind of you know explored with someone else as well you know like you know that's another thing that the reports are reporting bitch is that zayn allegedly is okay with selena dating other people but he really wants to see where this relationship goes so allegedly they're not you see you see how many other how many things are being said that they're moving in together, that they're being very serious, and now that they're in an open relation or an open thing until they get to know each other more. How much do you have to know each other since you've known each other since 2012, bitch, okay? Um, listen, I think maybe, yes, I think they went on a date. I think that maybe they hook up. I think that maybe they just have fun, but I don't know if Selena is ready um, to settle down. You know what I mean? I, I don't think so. I think she's, she's at the height of her popularity out of her career. 
I think that, you know, she's coming back to herself. She seems more confident than ever. And I would just hate for a heartbreak to fuck all that up because you guys know that a heartbreak can really mess us up. You know, it really does. It, it kind of takes away that shine. We become insecure. We become sad. We become depressed. And I just feel like she's on top right now. Rare is the biggest selling, you know, celebrity skincare, makeup, you know, only murders in a building. She's allegedly almost, you know, getting nominated for an Emmy again. She, you know, she's she has a very anticipated album. So if it was for new material for a new album, sure, girl, you know, do some research. But like, I just, I wouldn't play with the timing right now, if that makes sense. And I get it. Love is love. But, you know, I just, I've always been very, like, vocal about the fact that I really hope that Selena finds someone who is not in the entertainment business, you know, somebody who is out of the entertainment business. I just think that would be very refreshing for her. And I think that um, it would be very, very uh, different for her to, to, to date, like, I know, I know this is like crazy, but like, honestly, like an, an accountant, like, oh, you know, it'd be so cute. This will be so lifetime of the movie. Like, you know, she has to go into to, to her accountant money manager and he's like, you know, oh no, not her money manager because people get greedy and crazy. But okay, let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh, okay, no, 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 she, oh, I got it, bitch. So, you know, she's doing some research for her HBO cooking show, right? So she'll invite this like really cute, um, maybe like a, like a like a latino you know uh chef you know like a vegan holistic latino chef gorgeous beautiful and then you know he she invites him over to cook dinner for the girls to to test it out and to kind of get more tips right so she's you know so she's there maybe drinking some wine and he walks in he has a bandana and he's very very calm and sweet he doesn't know who the hell she is i mean he's he's heard of the name Cine Gomez, but doesn't know anything you know and they just hit it off and every bite of that mango crispy rice that he just made with the little garlic and tahini sauce dipped with the hummus and that peach beautiful sangria that he made. Girl, I already even made up the damn menu. And then they fall in love. And he, he has his own money. He's very successful. He does not need any money from Selena Gomez. And they can just live happily ever after in his like, you know, beautifully amazing house in the jungle and you know she can just just go to the jungle be loved get loved you know eat some bananas get some good mm -hmm, and then go back to work and then she's the happiest she's ever been and he's not on social media he doesn't know who anyone is he doesn't know who Haley bieber is he doesn't know who Liv jenner is he doesn't know who just he doesn't know anything about that that is who i think someone who is not in that world to be with her because you know i just feel like these celebrities, I don't understand why they always go for other celebrities. I get it. They, 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 you know, they follow the same uh, uh, scheduling and, you know, they understand that they have to travel, they have to do this. But I just feel like at some point in time also, you just want someone who does not have that ego. And I really do feel unfortunate that celebrities do get this like big ego. You know what I mean? So I just think someone grounded and, and sweet and romantic who writes poetry like Selena your eyes glimmer with love and hope and my spleener is yours to cedar i girl i cannot rhyme bitch i can barely read anyways what do you guys think let me know in the comments below do you think that they're moving into it do you think they're having fun what do you guys think let me know in the comments don't forget to have an amazing week i love you guys so much thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys in my next video Mwah.